Hi everyone, welcome to the First Principles channel. In today's video, we're going to look at how your mindset can play a role in your health. Alright, let's get it. Before we proceed, here's a special shout out to Algo Picante Sauce. The sauce that is made with love from Costa Rica. If you haven't tried them, you are absolutely missing something. A link will be left in the description of this video. Make sure you check them out. In our last video, we talked about stress and we discussed the fact that stress can be good or it can be bad, depending on your mindset. Please be sure to look in the description of this video for a link to that video so you can get more information. In today's video, we want to talk about how your mindset can play a role in your health. And we're going to discuss two concepts. The first concept is the placebo effect. The placebo effect is what happens when your mind tells you that your body will get better as a result going through some regimen or taking some medication. And in a lot of the instances, it actually works. Your mind does tell your body that it will get better and your body does feel stronger and healthier. The reality though is the medication you're taking is actually nothing. Probably, probably you've just had sugar mixed with water. But because your mind has worked on your body, your body responds and you do get better. There is a lot of science that backs up the idea that the placebo effect does work. The flip side to that coin is the nocebo effect. And just like the placebo effect, it is the reverse. And it happens that your mind can tell your body that a medical regimen or some medication will not work or that the side effects will be really, really, really bad. And so what happens is because your mind has told your body that message, then your body responds in the same manner and the side effects or the decision that your mind has made that this medical regimen will not work actually plays out to be a self-fulfilling prophecy. And so your body doesn't get better. Again, just like the placebo effect, there is a lot of science that shows that the nocebo effect is also real. So what does science say about the placebo and nocebo effects? Research shows that when the placebo effect is kicking in, it does work. And in a lot of instances, your body does get better. The flip side is actually worse. Research shows that when you're told that something is going to go wrong, your mind seems to go into a default of hyping up the wrong and things seem to get worse than better in a lot of the instances when your mind defaults into the negative zone. An example of how the nocebo effect can play up is with regards to some survey that was done on the beta blocker atenolol and its side effect of erectile dysfunction in men. Three groups of men were prescribed this medication. In the first group, no information was given to them. So they weren't told the name of the medication and they weren't told about any side effect. In the second group, they were just given the name of the medication but not told about any side effect. In the third group, the name and the side effect was explained to the patients. So what happened? In the first group, it was discovered that 3.1% of them suffered erectile dysfunction as a side effect. In the second group where they knew the name, that ratio went up to 15.6%. And in the third group where they knew both the name and the risk of the medication, guess what? Erectile dysfunction was reported in 31.2% of the men. 
what does that tell us? The mind can play a role in telling you that your body will get worse. So you need to just check your mind. What have we learned today? The default subconscious of your mind zones into the negative and you don't need to put in any effort for that to happen. To check this, you need mindfulness. You need to be mindful of what you're thinking and how you're pro processing information and you need to be conscious about thinking positive ideas because as we've seen from today's video, Thinking positively and thinking positive results and outcomes can actually have a strong bearing on your health. And if you don't check it, check it, the negative tendencies in your mind might be contributing to bad health without you realizing it. So there we go. You need to check your mind at all times because your mind has a way of defaulting to the negative. And as we've seen here, if you don't check it, it might just be ruining your health without you realizing it. Thanks for watching. Always please, if you enjoyed the video, do smash that like button. And while you're at it, if you haven't done so already, please, please, please subscribe, put a comment below, share the video with your friends, and please look us up on Instagram and Twitter. Enjoy.